Hi, I'm Teresa Rist, I'm a geoarchaeologist at the Desert Research Institute. And I'm looking forward to having you follow along on our journey as scientists to study this basin behind me. This is Coal Valley in Southern Nevada, and it is part of the Basin and Range National Monument. We're gonna be looking at the environmental history. In particular, this basin was once filled with an expansive lake. That was Pluvial Lake Coal, and all this remnant now is that white spot behind us, that playa. So we're gonna to try to figure out when that lake was at its high stand and if it was still there when people first arrived around 13,000 years ago. In addition, we're gonna to try to trace the recession of that lake to current conditions so that we can better understand the, the resources, the foodstuffs that were available to people throughout time. We look forward to having you follow along on this journey and hopefully in the next few years, we'll know a lot more about Coal Valley particularly its environmental and cultural history. What we first need to do to answer our research questions is understand the types of landforms in the valley and what shaped them. Second, we need to find datable remains in association with the lake to provide age control. And third, we need to find artifacts left by the earliest peoples that lived in the valley. In order to understand what shaped the landscape at different times, during the first year, we will map the landforms using aerial imagery and then go into the field to check these maps and look for datable remains. The types of materials that can provide age control include charcoal, shell, and other organics that we can radiocarbon date, volcanic tephras that we can geochemically identify to known eruption events, and buried sand that we can date using luminescence methods. After we know the age of the last high stand of Lake Coal, the second year we will model where people may have camped when they first arrived and then do archaeological surveys of these areas to look for artifacts they left behind. Wish us luck!